Yeah, the 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 show Friends though, uh, it's like yeah, the the, the main uh, uh, reason or the main goal of the characters in the show is to um, be like have more relationships. Yes. Right. And and the exact same thing is in the show Seinfeld. Well, yeah, I was gonna say that too. Yeah. You know, and they're all exactly the same thing, right? They're all um, devil worshippers. But you know, like like for and, instance, and Lane, when they're all as far as I'm concerned, Elaine she was funny, but she pretty much played a whore. I mean, let's yeah. face it. Yeah, she played the a Christian whore. A Christian right? whore. Um, and that was uh, the the whole point of her character was to guide uh, women in real life to do these things, right? I mean, that's what these shows are about. Yeah. Like if you, like the most famous scene that you see over and over again in Seinfeld is them sitting in the in the diner in the in the cafe right and every fucking scene behind Jerry's head is a painting of of a baseball field right mm. but when you really look at it it's not a baseball field it's the pentagram <laughs> they've altered the image right like it's probably like some satanic painter or whatever but it's it's made in a way that it shows a pentagram in the middle of the, of the baseball field. Wow. And it's always been there. It's in there every single episode. They never change the set. Uh -huh. Right? Eight seasons or whatever. And it's like, that's on purpose. That's totally on purpose. Because and, and the whole fact that his name is Seinfeld, it starts with an S. And in the, the show, behind the name Seinfeld is an, an, an oval, okay. a tilted oval, okay? That's the exact same symbol as, as the pentagram. It's the exact same thing. Wow. And there's an upside down triangle over the eye in Seinfeld. Oh. Okay? And a lot oh, of right, times yeah. they put checkered black and white squares within the the oval okay like all these things are pointing to him being satan like like indirectly right yeah. uh, almost every fucking show like of seinfeld he's wearing a red shirt <laughs> almost every single one like i mean yeah there are some episodes where he's not wearing a red shirt but for the majority, I'd say 70% of the show, he's wearing a red shirt. Jerry? Yeah, Jerry Seinfeld. <laughs> okay, like, you can obviously, if you, if you got Netflix, you can put it on your big screen and you can, you know, yeah, film you with, it, with your phone up against up against the screen and and you could see that they're not they're not entirely human like their eyes are not like ours right they're not uh round <laughs> right. Um, so it's like, the, the whole premise of the show is, is completely evil, right? And it, it, it's used, the show is used to control the populations that are watching the show yeah. into doing the same things, monkey see, monkey do, right? That's, that's the whole point of Hollywood in the first place, right? Is to tell you, not right. just tell you how the world is, but tell you how to act in the world. Right. You know, and yeah, like the whole uh, Matthew Perry thing on Friends, it's like, yeah, he dies and all of a sudden there's all these interviews that nobody's seen before of him saying yeah. how he he prayed for his fame and fortune and he got it, but it and was he, a he, twisted he, fate because, yeah, he became an addict and all this other stuff. Yeah. 
But it's like, yeah, but that's even that's going even further. Like it's like taking the story, like the show, yeah. which is already like telling you what to do and how to act, and then it goes even further, and it's like this guy died, and this is his real life, right? And then, yeah. and it's like it's still telling people what to do. Yeah. My prayed, and it was the first time. Um, it was like a prayer of like a fourteen-year-old. And I was 24, something like that. And I just read that some celebrity, I don't remember, who was in trouble. And I thought to myself, he doesn't care. He's famous. What difference does, he, difference does that make? He's famous. He has it all. And then I knelt down and said, God, you can do whatever you want to me. Just please make me famous. And three weeks later, I got friends. And God didn't forget about the first part. <laughs> hmm, what do I want to do to him? Yeah. <laughs> that kind of Faustian bargain. Very I bad made. disease at yeah. the same time. And uh, then deep into addiction, there was a more, much more real prayer, you know, to save my life. You know, <laughs> like it's, you know, the whole thing of do as thou wilt is like, it's completely fucking insane. That's the whole message behind every show, every movie, every song. It's telling you do what you want to do. Don't 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 do what's what's been told for you to do. Like, yeah. Like there's nobody watching you. That's pretty much what it what it's saying. There's nobody looking. Just do it.